What's up, DJ Booth? I'm Brendan Varan. Dances come and go, but no dance quite transfixed the nation like the dab. From its humble beginnings in the trap to its peak when over 120 million Americans watched the Super Bowl, waiting for their chance to dab alongside Cam Newton, its rise was simply meteoric. To honor its too short life, we took a look back at the life and times of the dab. Let's take it back to summer 2014. There's still some confusion as to who actually started the dab. It was probably some nameless teenager in Atlanta, or maybe even Dee Brown in the 91 dunk contest. But for all intents and purposes, it was the quality control crew that truly started the wave. Migos, Rich the Kid, and maybe most prominently, Skippa da Flippa. Okay, fast forward to winter 2015, and the dab is officially popping. While Vine and Snapchat helped spread it to teenagers across America, it wasn't until athletes like LeBron James and Cam Newton started doing it that it eventually exploded on the mainstream. From people jumping in behind live news broadcasts to politicians trying and failing to seem cool while dabbing on Ellen, there wasn't a corner of American culture that the dab didn't touch. What started in Atlanta trap circles officially became the 2015 version of the Macarena or the electric slide. For all of the millions of dabs that were in fact dabbed though, there were perhaps none greater than this kid who managed to pull it off during a Christian ministry pledge drive. We salute this American hero. And that brings us to June 20th, 2016, when TMZ caught up with Migos outside of LAX and Quavo said what has been obvious for months now, the dab is being retired. It will certainly take some time to taper off just as quickly as it rose. J.R. Smith was just dabbing after the Cavs won the NBA championship, and Designer will probably keep dabbing for the foreseeable future, as I'm not sure it's physically possible for him to not be dabbing. But one thing's clear, the life support has been pulled. Feel free to do one more dab in remembrance. For DJ Booth TV, I'm Brendan Varan. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, and as always, keep it locked to the booth.